A father has a special intuition when it comes to their daughters. Sometimes you just know. Some time ago, back in 2010, it was Lentley's fourth grade year, he looked around the room to find the cutest boy, and there he was. Of course, that boy was Soren. Lentley told me all about him, and I knew. Around the spring of her sixth grade year, Lentley and I were talking about Soren. Dad, do you think we'll get married? Now, this had my attention. I said, no, 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 I doubt that. I doubt that. Not long after that, toward the end of sixth grade, they suffered a tough breakup. She was crushed, we were hurt, to see her hurt. But after all, this was a sixth grade relationship, so life goes on. Fast forward to fall sports senior night. Out of nowhere, she says, hey dad, look, there's Soren, number 27. Are you guys talking or dating or something? She said, no, no, just pointing them out. I told Kim later that night, it won't be long and Luntley and Soren will be dating again. Just a few short months later, they were dating again. Wow, that was quick, how'd you know? And I said, I just knew. And I knew there was never gonna be anybody in this world that Luntley would ever love as much as Soren. And today, when I walk my beautiful little girl down the aisle, toward this cute little boy <laughs> named Soren. I wasn't sad, but I was happy. And I knew he would care for her, and he would comfort her and protect her, and he'd provide for her, and he would cherish her as much as she cherishes him. And that brought me great peace, because I knew.